Hello YouTube! This is Skyfire the Pokemon Animatic and I am bringing you a Pokemon Black and White 2 Wi-Fi battle video. This battle is against Razar from the Zod Pokemon Wi-Fi room. Now looking at the team and I was looking at myself, this would be rather strange because I don't see really much in the ways of Ubers or overused in this one. But I am looking funny about that Whimsicott. And you know how Whimsicott or Prankster could really be a pain. It was, in a sense. But the battle is rather interesting even with that. And that Snorlax too. So let's just show you how this battle went. I'm going to start off with Beecher. That is my civic here, of course. He's going to bring in Galilee. I'm going to go for a nasty plot because I really didn't know what Galley was going to do. I saw the hypnosis and I was thinking like, really? So he switches out Galley, brings in Toxicoke. And I was wondering why? Because even for the most part, what else that could be done to Galley besides me using the flamethrower? Well, which I used the one he KO Toxicroak. So here comes Aerodactyl. Now this is where I have a little funny. And there's a reason why. Because isn't Aerodactyl's name spelled A-E-R-O-D-A-C-T-Y-L? Um, where's the C-T-Y-L? I don't know. That would really the matter. Use Rock Sly and of course Beach is gone. The question, I'm, I'm questioning about the name itself. And there's a reason why, I'll explain later. He's going to use Iron here to try and flinch me, but that didn't work. So now he goes for the Earthquake, but it didn't matter either because I had a Sugar Bear. And since Arrow that, and since that Earthquake was established, I lived that easily. Thank you to the sword stance, I get the ice ring off and it's going to one hit KO the Aerodactyl. Which I explained might be a little bit ginned in a way, but then I don't know. Gelly comes back in and well, I'm gonna go for a Night Slash, which is again stab and times two. It's not super effective, but with the low defenses on that thing, I knew it was going to be a one-hit KO. So Galilee's gone, here comes Snorlax, and I'm going to go for a critical hit on the cross poison. Maybe I should have kept with the Night Slash, but I want to at least get a poison on it. That didn't happen. So, I live with 22 HP. So I said, let me see if this is going to KO that thing. It did not. So it's going to use the Citrus Berry while it goes for Ice Punch yet again. That was interesting. Nice punch on the Snorlax. Where's the Earthquake? Speaking of. So I'm going to bring in Seven Mile. That is my Salk. Shiny, surprisingly. I'm going to go for a bulk up, not knowing what that Snorlax has. It might have been hit, but well, I saw a Thunder Punch and this was, I was thinking, really? Thunder Punch and Ice Punch? What kind of a Snorlax is this? I was expecting maybe Zen hit, but or Earthquake or something like that. And uh, there go another Thunder Punch again. Is this thing trying to paralyze me? Well, it's not working. Speaking of Thunder Punch, I'm going to use that to KO the Snorlax. So here comes something Japanese. Oh, it has to be Electros. Um, yeah. I have Superpower, and for this matter, it is time, it is plus two. So, that plus two goes down to plus one. Not till after I KO the Electros and one hit. Thank you very much. So, the last Pokemon happens to be the one I have a problem with. Is that Doggone Whimsicott. 
I thought it was going to be slower, but then of course, Whimsicott has Prankster, so Substitute is going to be a little bit faster. I'm going to go for Superpower to put me down to normal stats, because I'd already bucked up plus two against the Stone Axe. I already used Superpower twice, so I'm back to normal. So I think to myself, how am I going to get this thing off? Yeah, I tried Stone Axe. Yeah, that was a flop. But, I'm going to try for Stone Edge yet again. And it worked. Thank goodness. But, there is a problem with that Giga Drain. Uh, yeah, that close. That close. So, it's going to go for sub again. This is going to be very, very, very interesting if I actually get this Winston cut out. I'm going to go for a superpower to guarantee myself for at least that to be gone. Even though now I'm down to minus one attack and minus one defense. Even though all my focus is, is mainly on that anyway. Well, this is on special, special defense. I'm going to go for stone if I get the crit I was looking for. Because even though I'm at minus one, minus, minus one, minus one, special attack, special defense, I get the Stone Age off, it's a crit, Kazo the Whimsicott, and that is good game to Razer. I'm now about that Iridactyl. Is it, is, is your Pokesavin come out the whole name? I already know, I see a lot of Iridactyls with A E R O D A. I think that's what the second one I've seen, even though I don't have it recorded, I already know that one. But at least for the most part, I did win the game. I don't know. I don't know how the air that got legit anyway, but who knows? Whew. I was glad I got rid of Snorlax, and then Winsicott's gone too. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Salk. I guess that's how it is. Rate, comment, subscribe. Skyfire scene. See you next time.